with you for one last ride, Sparrow. Hey, Sparks. It's been a long day. Not you, my friend. I'll tell you about when I see you again. Ah, ah. <laughs> oh, fucking God. <laughs> Welcome back to Gamblers. Welcome back. We're playing Spyro Reignited Trilogy. This is the first game uh, in uh, in the show. Wow, this is a really close camera. I feel like it's not. It hasn't been this close before. <laughs> Kiss me, Dragon Boy. <laughs> We're playing uh, the first game. We're doing high caves. We're making our way through the Magic Crafters worlds. I'm making my way downtown, walking fast. Fated Pajam Homo Uh It's not this level, right, that I hate no, this is the tarantula no, I, one. I think this is the level that you hate. Uh no, I don't hate this one. This is the Oh yeah, I know exactly which one you're talking about. The one with the spiders and the fucking No, no, you hate the one like the Crystal Cave one. It's got that... fucking ice everywhere. Did we already do that one? Yeah. No, I love that level. Oh, I fucking hate that level. I love the aesthetic. God, it's so aesthetically pleasing. It is. Ah! There's a fucking dingleberry at the top. Boom. Man. Cyrus. What up? Oh, he a thick boy. Yeah, I'll do my best. I, they're on the fucking path. Why do you have so many candles? Because he's a dragon. Dragon breathe the fire. Hey. You think, like, as dragons get, like, stronger and older, they fucking start blowing blue flame? Um, I think that's... Uh, they probably wouldn't when they, like... Not like when they're old and wrinkly and jump old off. and gray. I don't want to. Jump off. No, because it fucking puts me where I don't want to be. Don't be a fucking bitch about it. No. I'm going to be the bitch boy. Yeah, you are. Ajax. Like the fucking... Francis? I hate those <laughs> when I become big and strong like you, I'll squash them all. You think so? Remember that supercharge makes Why does he look... Like, Barney had a love child with the fucking jester from Pandemonium. <laughs> I just don't like his hat. They're magic crafters. Why is he dressed like a fucking circus clown? Like a court jester. Court jester. Yeah, not so much a circus clown, just the court jester. What's up with this platform? Why doesn't he just fucking do anything? Because it just slams up into the ceiling and fucking nice, kills Nice, crushes you. me. Yeah, I'd probably, uh, I probably would have deserved it, honestly. Bing bong. I also really appreciate that they went out of their way to make the liquid in this game look actually dangerous. Yeah. Like. Not just fucking blue. Yeah. Not trying to fucking jab at PlayStation 1 oh graphics God. at all, but like. Yeah, there was only so much that they could do to make fucking liquid in that game look threatening. Yeah, they could only cram so many fucking pixels onto the screen at, the screen at once. And, like, particle physics didn't fucking exist yet in yeah. technology, so... Get back here! The fucking place to get him is at that jump. Got him. Alright, and just double check this route for fucking treasure. I think I got it all, but there was also like a second part that I didn't go down. Okay. Yeah, we're good. We Gucci. Ah. Yeah, there was only like particle physics didn't or just didn't just barely didn't exist. Um, Where are you going? Twinkle, oh. twinkle, little star. Nice. Yeah. Uh, run down that. Thanks, ladies. You really helped me out. 
big boom. Shibuya. No, this isn't Shibuya. We Cedric. Over this. What? It's not Shibuya. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. a fucking city. I know. This is Tokyo. No. <laughs> you are incorrect. It's Hokkaido. <laughs> Okinawa. <laughs> Hokkaido. Hokkaido. What, isn't that the Alaska of Japan? I don't fucking know. <laughs> no, it's another reference. Is you it? probably don't get it at all. No, I don't. It's the second... It's the third uh, Splinter Cell game. Oh, yeah. No, I don't. Hey, here's your favorite fucking... I hope Fucker. that was worth it. It was worth it. I have to chase that motherfucker. The game wants you to fucking chase him around the lake, but I'm not doing that shit. It's a pond. It's not a lake. It's a pond. But I'm not doing that shit, cuz... Look at me, platforming the master. Boink. All right, now I have to go get kissed by a fairy. And that's not even a that's joke. That's not a euphemism. Yeah, I literally have to get kissed by a fucking fairy. Where are you? Uh. Die. Die, you fuck boy. Got it. Give me a fucking kiss. Give me your power up, lady. See how reluctant she was? No, she wasn't. No, she was. Spy was like, I didn't have gum in my mouth. <laughs> More! See, she's a boop! Where are you going? Going around. I'm going around town. Ha blah! Alright. Please let the spider be close. Unless I already killed it. Ah! Hey, he's just vibing, bro. I killed this one, though, with the supercharge. Yeah. Fucking kill the rest of them with the supercharge. You're right, I could kill this one with the supercharge easy peasy. Can you though? Yep. I'm sure. Can you ready you, for this? Can you make that turn? Are you ready for this? He just has to be like in the middle of the floor. Hello! You know, my fucking snout. How many concussions do you think Spyro has had, like, in his One, life? two, three, four, five. Because, like, five. that shit's gotta hurt. Yeah, he's not Because you even... know those horns are, like, directly, like, no, he's fused not... to the skull. See, here's the thing. He's not even hitting with, like, the horn part like he's supposed to be. He's hitting with his forehead. Look at him charge. Yeah, why? I don't know. Show me more. Show me the way, Sparks. <laughs> Sparky boy. Uh, hello. Sparks do be knowing the way. What? Oh yeah, they're up here. I didn't do any fucking backtracking before, so I gotta jump onto that rooftop. What was that? That was Shep. <laughs> Sleep. Those poor fucking sheep. <laughs> They're just minding their own business. And then a fucking purple dragon comes out of nowhere. And just lights them on fire. He's like, hey, dinner. Fuck. There's ten gems left. Mm. This level's so fucking complicated. Ugh. <gasps> fine everything's fine a little more fucking faith in yourself dude i don't you saw me fucking fail like three fucking glides in just the last episode alone in this one no oh, that's the portal chest yoink 
Hey. Now we done. Ayo. Look at that. Nice. We done. I'm done. Lunch. <laughs> Yo, the reference episode was the last episode. Every episode is a reference episode if you know what you're doing. Fucking fair enough. That just goes to show like how impressionable video games uh, were when... Because that's Twin Sanity, right? Yeah. I think probably the Yeah, least... it's after you beat Mecha Bandicoot. There's fucking uh, Ripperoo and Dingo Dial. The most quotable games... Are probably from the PS2 and Xbox era. Oh yeah, one hundred percent. I can pro I could say, with a, beyond like a shadow of a doubt, that like, with the exception of s games that are specifically fucking huge, like, um, The Last of Us and like God of War, Metal Gear Solid. Yeah. Games just aren't as deep in their fucking narrative as they used to be. So you get fantastic fucking bangers of quotes from, uh, do I need to go around first? I don't know. Look at the fucking reflections on this. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Look at the reflections on our wall. Hell yeah. Now jump in. No. Let the intrusive thoughts win, Matthias. Jump no. in. If it didn't fucking kill me, I would jump into the goo. This is a very satisfying sound effect to killing the it's sheep. It's fucking sad. It's awesome. That sheep is just minding its own, its own business. You're at full health, and you're like, nah, fuck <laughs> these sheep. <laughs> Another. Uh, fucking right into the into the ether, like. <laughs> Aether, ether, ether. Finally, the sweet embrace of death! Don't jump down yet. You can't hide from me! <laughs> fucking, he was cowering in the corner. He was not even being close. He and I was like, yeah. knew what was going on. He was trying to hide from you. That's funny. And Spiral's like, there's one left. Where is he? He's <laughs> like, this isn't the only platform I can go to, right? Oh! <laughs> you bully. <laughs> How is he the bully? You're going into his world. He's a nork. He's a fucking bully. Plot to a Spyro is the bad guy in the game. What? Nasty Nork is clearly the fucking perpetrator of heinous crimes against the fucking dragons. It's like very obvious. That's He's turning... Want. That's what they want you to think. The dragons hoard the treasure, right? Which, you know, in of itself it sounds bad, but, like, that's just dragon nature is to hold on to this fucking treasure and shiny shit. And then fucking Nasty Nork comes along and is like, hey, what if I gave life to the treasure? Yeah, the fucking dragons are like, oh my god! Dragons are like, motherfucker's spitting. <laughs> oh, uh, damn, that's not how you get up there. I, I will mean... have to go back and fucking. Uh oh. Damn it. But you get after me for fucking lighting a cat on fire in Hogwarts. Because this is how you gain lives in this game. You were specifically just bullying the fucking animals in that game. Oh, you fucked that up. You weren't at the top of your jump before you pressed the glide button. You're right. I'm a failure. Absolute fucking travesty. Fucking get good, scrub. I just barely got that 26th life and I just fucking pissed it away. Well, don't worry, because you'll get it back soon. I hope so. Oh! What? Buddy. Uh -huh. It's deflating my ego really bad. 
What? I'm, I'm normally able to get that fucking jump on the first try. It's upset. It's performing under pressure. Ah! I didn't fucking jump at the top of the thing again. This fucking jump is gonna kill me. I'm gonna game over because of this jump. I'm gonna fucking laugh if you die 23 more times. I would abs. I just. I'd quit. That would be the finale episode. Just the episode in which I would series. die. Yeah. If I were to get a game over, I would just fucking quit right there. There you go. Oh, did I? I don't even think I needed to glide. I probably could have just made it if I fucking stuck on the jump. Eat my ass. That was probably the easiest fucking thief. Yeah, because he doesn't run away. They had to, like... Oh, man. How do you get back? I have to fucking glide down there. Oh, so you mean ah! skip half the fucking level? Yeah. I also need that super jump, or that super charge again. What do These you are probably want? the most fucking aggressive enemies in this entire game. They definitely hit when they're supposed to. All of the enemies do not. Reese's, it is too goddamn hot to be cuddling in this fucking room right now. Do you have any words for us? No? Nothing? Fuck off Obama with Obamacare doesn't work! <laughs> <laughs> My cat just said something like ridiculously politically aligned. Bush did 9-11. 9-11 was an inside job. Epstein didn't kill himself. <laughs> it's my fucking cat. <laughs> yeah. My cat just says something fucking completely out of pocket. I wouldn't put it past the furry asshole. Noink. It's noinks. Uh, wow, he didn't actually... My speak. cranium! <laughs> My fucking scully. <laughs> my scoliosis. <laughs> oh no, my skull. Ah! I really like that they changed these from giant spheres that or giant poles that go on the ground to these floating little things. That's really cool. And they even have the little swirling effect around the base. It's really cool level design. These guys knew what the fuck they were doing, dude. Toys for Bob is so talented. I love them so much. Thank you for making this game. This is the fucking remake that we didn't know we needed. Exactly. Well, I mean, I think we knew that we needed the fucking- uh, it, What?! I wasn't even on the same level as you, dude! Oh my god! I think I hate them even more now. I would've fucking pissed myself if you got hit by that one Another too. one. <laughs> Oh, no, uh, fuck you. Managed to get it just in time. 444. Damn, that's a lot of eggs. All eggs found. Like, in the whole game? No. Oh. <laughs> fuck off! You did this. <laughs> Blow fire up your taint. <laughs> I will set your prostate on fire. <laughs> This, everybody knows the prostate is on the other side of the tank. Motherfucker's got a power cell on his head. Is that what that is? It's not actually a power cell, it's just a fucking... But that's uh, that would be like a really fucking crazy awesome reference if that was true. That'd be fucking amazing. I, I mean, it's very... I don't want to say obvious, but it's like definitely not, right? But if it was, yeah, that would be awesome. Whoa. Oh ah! my god! Oh no. Oh my god, please. Please, please. Oh my god! That's definitely not how you're supposed to get there, but holy shit. That was awesome. Do it again, do it again, do it again. I'm try. Because there's fucking crates up there you need. Yeah, I know. I need to go around. I need to do this fucking trick again. Where I go to the front of the stage and turn around. Mm -hmm. Magic Crafters Homeworld is where the levels start like really ramping up in level complexity. Because the first, the artisan worlds are just super simple. You can fucking bang them out, they have a start and a stop point. 
And then some to all you need to do is go to the end of a path to get the key to find the fucking um to yeah. find the treasure chest. Peacekeepers get a little bit more difficult with it by putting keys and chests at the end of glide paths. This game just makes fucking take it a piss on level design. Look at this shit. How the fuck are you supposed to know to glide around that corner like that without like a strategy guide? How the fuck are you supposed to find that out? You fucking no. You're not. I thought I was doing another funny, funny jump trick. Uh, that wasn't very funny. I'm concussed. I see black and white now. <laughs> I forgot the letter V. Hey, Spyro, what colored gems do you need? I need a gray and a dark gray. <laughs> Spyro, what's your favorite color gem? I like the white one, John. Th There's no white gray gem, Spyro. What are you talking about? It's right there. Spyro, that's a green gem. What's green? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this should be just fucking blowhard now, which... Yay. <laughs> My favorite kind of blow. I'm very tired. Did you just tell me you like meth? Blows coke. Oh. Do you like cocaine? What? No. Uh. No, I don't like coke. <laughs> Disclaimer. Marshall does not do drugs. However, if you wanted to mail us drugs, you could send it to <laughs> P.O. Box 42069. Insert P.O. Box here. Mm -hmm. No, please don't do that because that's that that's highly illegal. I'm I <laughs> send drugs through the mail. Yeah, I'm pretty sure both parties would get in trouble. It's drug trafficking 101 right there. No, it's okay. It's just salt for the bakery. If you're gonna do it, don't get caught. Right. But no, it's fine. I just asked my pen pal for a cup of sugar. My pen pal. This is the first package you've sent to each other, sir. Uh, email. Okay, great. Here's here's a here's here's a warrant for your email account. Uh, I deleted it. <laughs> I'm fairly certain they could just ask Google because they don't actually like. But once it's on the internet, it's there forever. Yeah, man, the internet's forever. Hey, what up, Altair? You want to know it isn't Altair. forever? Altair is doing acid. What's not forever? Bitches. Oh. Bitches will be forever. N no. They have and will continue to be forever. Mayo is forever. Mm -hmm. There's another fucking reference. Jesus Christ. Patrick, mayo's not an instrument. Mayonnaise is not an instrument. Mayonnaise is not an instrument. My fucking Squidward impression sucks. No, I, I was I was referencing good old Charlie. Charlie Sheen? No, no, moist. <laughs> moist moist critical. Moist crucial. Oh yeah, you blow that tornado. I did. I said Mom Fire. Do it again. It was a pedophile. You do it again. <laughs> I, I like when you set the tornado on fire. That would be the scariest fucking thing I could imagine. Just a fire tornado? Yeah, literally a fucking tornado made a fire hurtling towards me. How the fuck am I supposed to deal with that, Marshall? You can't run from that. <laughs> you accept your fate. <laughs> and it's not even going to be fun either. You get swept up in flames, dude. You're getting fucking thrown through the air while also on fire. Could fire technically thrive in a tornado? Um, maybe. If I, I, maybe? I don't know if it would. 
Well, because, like, fire tornadoes exist in wildfires. Because I don't know, like... As long as they have something to burn, I think they would be fine. Yeah, I don't think, like, if in there was internally, I don't think it would because the inside of a tornado is a vacuum. If they, um... If a fire tornado had the stuff to actually, like, catch fire within it, I think it would. If there was still, like, brush and trees and dry stuff inside to okay. burn... Hear me out. Yeah. Science experiment. You want to start fire in the backyard? Yes. Okay. We need to find a way to artificially create a tornado. Mm hmm And we'll try this. We'll go get, like, a fucking air cannon from Home Depot or something. <laughs> we'll make a fucking... Okay. Hear me out. We're going to build the potato gun. What? I don't think a potato gun is capable of starting a tornado. You'd be surprised. Yay, we're in the Beastmakers! Fucking hate the Beastmakers. Really? Yeah. This is probably my... I, I hate the home world. Really? Yeah. This is like my second favorite fucking world. Specifically because of those fucking assholes right there. Fucking... Hey, Marshall. It's you from, uh, 8th grade. You right. <laughs> Yeah, I was constantly just <laughs> fucking electrocuting myself in the 8th grade, you right. With fucking crop tops and fucking noise kits, like a headphones. And a mohawk. Okay, the... What is that thing on his head? It has spikes. Like, it's part of his horn and everything, but it fell off his head. I thought that, that was the attack frogs guy. No, the attack frog guy is in the actual swamp level. Attack? Frogs? What is that? Shine me. Mm. Alright, here we go. Oh! Pumba! You're a long way from home, Pumba. Let me send you back to your people. In hell! Say hi to Mufasa for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, from a distance, I thought that said Nasty Bog instead of Misty Bog. That's such a... Mu I like that name a lot better than Misty Bog. Spyro, I just got done creating some hallucinogenic moss. You want to come back to my basement and get fucked I up? I just got done checking my moonshine stills. <laughs> you want to hit your swing? I was like, fuck yeah! Let's get smashed! This whole fucking adventure is just a really bad acid trip for Spyro. Mm -hmm. Spyro, what are you talking about? No, the dragons didn't get kidnapped. No, what, what are you talking about? Sp Nasty Nork? Who the fuck is that? Sparks isn't real. <laughs> just made up fucking... Hey, do that flight level. No. I just fucking blew up Ugh. a mushroom. I'm not gonna do it yet. First, I, I fucking 100% the fucking homeworld before I do any of the other levels. Oh yeah, shoot your magic at me. Shut your mouth, that's gross. Ah! Uh! Say hello to my little friend. He goes, foy foy. My little friend Spyro. Light that shit on fire, bro. The fuck was that? Chicken. 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 Is that all? Oh, hey. Hello. Bye. That's so gross. Splooshes. Yeah, exactly. That's cat. That's, that's cuck -a. He went sploosh. Oh, cuck -a. I went hee hee hoo hoo. Time to sploosh. On Riku. <laughs> no! <laughs> Fucking gross! Marshall, if that is it's okay, this is a safe space. You can admit that you used to fucking blow loads on the Riku drawing in the fucking Kingdom Hearts manual. <laughs> this is a safe space. <laughs> nah, bro. Nah. Uh, before you say it, before you say it, I must remind you. 
<laughs> they are both canonically 14 in that game. Oh, I was gonna say, fucking <laughs> the Final Fantasy X-2 Riku on the jam pack case. Okay, I am willing to concede that she is of legal age, but I am also going to be surprised if she is not. Oh, don't be <laughs> good. Oh, fuck. What do you mean? Are Rescue you so 50. sorry? Rescued 50 dragons? Two more. God damn it. Alright, I think this is the first home world that you cannot complete. Uh, completely bypass if you don't do all the levels in front of it. Ooh, I retract my previous statement. About Riku? She's fucking 17. What? She's 17 and 10 too. She's only 17. She's 15 and 10. Damn. Why is she so young? Are you sure? That can't be right. Oh, no. I just cut that whole last segment out. <laughs> <laughs> no, I gotta leave it in the episode. Well, no, because if you think about it, I was a kid at the time. That's true. You were crushing on a MILF. Or what you th assumed was a MILF. No, I didn't assume. You didn't assume? I didn't assume she was a MILF. But, like, definitely tend to Riku over... Fair enough. Because, like, she's got knives in 10 too. She just got a fucking brass knuckle in 10. Nice. They're all done. Next time on Game Brothers... We're um, gonna continue to be fucking predatory men. <laughs> no! <laughs> We're gonna go into the nasty bog. Um, I don't know. Wait, wait. yeah, the nasty bog. No, misty bog. The nasty bow boogaloo. The electric boogaloo? <laughs> yeah, that. We're gonna go... <laughs> gonna rock down to Electric Avenue. Well, I just saw a fucking chicken. Well, fuck it. There you are, you bastard. Give me a life. Give me a kiss. Spiral's like, are you too fucking done? Bye! <laughs>